So after the long confusing story, <laughs> we are heading to the Chocobo Farm. Quick! <laughs> I love Chocobos. This is about one of my favorite scenes in the game, and it's just, just, just awesome. Can't go wrong with Chocobo. There's the farm. Just go up to the first one and go work. The first option, they'll do the dance for you. <laughs> oh yeah. And then you get the summon. Your first summon, Chocomog, which is a wind wind elemental. And occasionally has a chance to paralyze enemies. Pretty good. Pretty good. So you need the Chocobowler, which costs two grand. Uh, and then you need at least, you know, two nuts, three nuts if you want. Go in the field, watch the video, catch a Chocobo. Don't get hit by the <laughs> Midgar Zalam, or else you're gonna get screwed over, like I did a few times. Make sure to equip your Toko Bowler. You don't have to be in the hooves. You actually have to be just on the green. Um, don't get me wrong. This does take a few tries to get it. It only looks like I got on the first try because I'm video editing it. <laughs> I actually tried about three, four times. A few times the Chocobos ate the freaking green so quickly that it was just like ridiculous and he was gone some people like to put the green at the very very top of your items by going through the menu items customize then do it yourself but you have to keep the chocobo eating essentially he, he can go for a break for like one or two seconds but if he has like one or two turns I think it is he will flee See, I probably could have left him and just hit the monster again, but just to make sure, I fed him another green. So once you got him, you will want to proceed over the sands. And now watch for the dark shadow. It's on the left side, I think. Yeah, there it is. Left side. As soon as you hit the sands, it will start coming for you. So just try to avoid it. If you do fight it, you will die. Sephiroth being a badass, or his clone, I should say. So, continue on the path, go in the mountains, make a right. Now this is one of the secret areas that you won't be able to see with the select button either. Those vines on the left hand side there, you can press E on. And you climb them. Long range material is very nice due to the ability that you can put like cloud <laughs> on the back line and 
continue to do the same amount of damage but take 50% reduced damage. Very useful. Very, very useful. You'll run into the Turks here. Jeez. I remember way, way back on Yahoo Instant Messenger, the chat rooms. I used to uh, RP chat. I remember people, this is when this game was like very popular, and people had all these like Shinra, Neo Shinra, Neo Migger clans and like groups, and the Turks, and ugh. What a life. Tenge likes the likes Earth, so that's why he's all like, "Ooh, where where is she?" <laughs> I'd always recommend to carry five quantity of any beneficial medicine on you, like tranquilizers, fury. Stuff like that. Just because it sucks when you don't have the cure for them.